Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode. We're going to be painting the aquarium, the 40 gallon that we have. Hi. We're going to be painting the back, one of the backs, and the bottom. Now, I've never painted any aquariums before, uh, so I don't know what to expect or how it's going to come out. So this is going to be my first time. Um, the other goldfish are doing really well. Uh, as if you haven't seen any of my previous episodes, you notice that we just recently purchased these little telescope eyes and the little oranda. So they're doing really well. They're eating, uh, no problems with them. The, actually, the little oranda is actually starting to turn a little bit more black on the cheeks uh, than before, but they're all swimming around, doing really well. Uh, we're gonna take you with us today. Uh, we're gonna go buy some paint. <laughs> so we're gonna take you, take you with us. We're gonna go buy some paint. So stick around for that, guys. Say bye. All right guys, so we just left our local craft store. Uh, we ended up picking up a bottle of acrylic paint. This thing was fairly cheap, $3. Uh, they had some smaller ones for 79 cents, so I just went ahead and, and picked up the bigger one for $3. Uh, so, But they didn't have any good rollers in there. Uh, was, I was kind of surprised because it is a craft store. So we're gonna head across the street to Lowe's and try to find some good rollers. I was trying to film in the store, but with my daughter running around and me trying to film and all the people that were in there, it was just kind of crazy. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so it's kind of crazy. Uh, like I said, we're gonna go to Lowe's, so stick around. All right guys, so we just finished up with Lowe's. My daughter's ready to take a nap. Yeah, you got fries. Uh, she's ready to take a nap. I went ahead and bought a paint roller kit. I don't have one of these, so we got the foam one. Uh, this was about $6. We ended up picking up uh, some tape. I don't think you need tape, but I went ahead and picked it up. So anyways, uh, we're gonna tape around it. So I don't think you need this, uh, but I got it anyways. So all together with the, with the supplies, I don't think we spent no more than $13. So that's not bad, that's pretty cheap. Uh, we're gonna go home and start painting. My daughter's ready to take a nap, so we'll catch you guys up in a little bit. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is put some rubbing alcohol on here and kind of clean the surface. This is the bottom, so I flipped it upside down, and then we're gonna go through the paint, and then I'll probably mask it and roll the paint. So we're gonna use the alcohol first, so give me a second. All right guys, so we're gonna use the acrylic paint. Don't know how this is gonna go. I'm not sure if it's got a safety. I'm gonna use some of that. Ew. Okay, we're just gonna start rolling. Like I said, I've never done this before. I don't know what to expect. So we'll just keep rolling.
We actually ended up doing four coats to it. I actually started running out of paint, so I went to the store and bought more paint. This is the type I use. I bought it from Michaels. It's acrylic paint. So these were three bucks. So I ended up getting two of them. I think this one's still about halfway full. Uh, like I said, the one thing that I, I would recommend is for you guys to get these little corner edges so you guys could get it right in the corners. Um, the masking tape did help, uh, especially right now getting it off. Um, it didn't get any paint on this. So if you want to protect the corners, um, go ahead and get the masking tape. So like I said, I'm happy with it. It came out really good. Um, nice and glossy. The only thing that I don't like is that when they built the aquarium, uh, they put one of the little inspection tags in it and it kind of get it got embedded. So I'm going to have to live with it. It's just going to, it's going to stay there. So it is what it is. Um, my daughter's eating a banana. Say hi. hi. So we got the fish over there. They're doing pretty good. Alright guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. This was my first time or my first attempt at painting an aquarium. I've never done it. Um, it was super cheap. I think the most I spent was probably $16 if that. So uh, really under $20 you could do this. Um, I still have some paint left. Yeah. Okay, give me one second mama. So I still have some paint left. Um, like I said, I still got tape left for, for next tank. So... Um, it came out really nice. I think the next project is going to be is to try to build um, a canopy for this aquarium. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Um, I'm going to try to get some different uh, perspectives on, on how to do it. Um, I know if I don't do anything, my daughter will start <laughs> throwing stuff in here. So that's going to be a thing that I'm going to have to start doing is, is try to figure out how to do a uh, canopy. Uh, so on the next video, I'm probably going to be tackling the canopy or the stand. So it's all starting to add up. It's starting to shape up. Um, so stick around. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Please subscribe if you haven't. I want to thank all the new subscribers that I've recently uh, acquired. Uh, so I do want to appreciate that um, and all the comments that I've been getting. So um, again, thank you for watching this video. I hope this helps. Um, if you have any questions on it, let me know. But it came out pretty awesome. I'm happy with it. So, again, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. So, have a great day.